My name is Sarah Donoghue, I'm 24 years old and I'm from Herne Bay in Kent. That's enough milk, then put it on the tray. My name is Louis Hoyan, I'm 22 years old, I'm from Canterbury. Our ITV Fixers project is to help young people with learning difficulties who want to move away from home. At the moment I live with my mum and dad. I like to live on my own in the flat. I find it hard to get out because I have a condition like agoraphobia. I'm being helped by this organisation called Looking Ahead, which helps people with learning needs. Some of the students that have special needs have been saying that they want to move forward and live independently. I would love to learn how to budget, look after the house. How to make more friends. People should get more help being independent and looking after their own money. We're making a resource pack to give people information what independent living is all about. So you're going to make people more aware of the challenges they're going to face and also the advantages. Yeah, they are going to need support. Right. I need to learn more cooking. Uh-huh. How to prepare food. Yeah. Washing up, Ryan. Washing up is a part of living, yeah. Today, ITV Fixers have arranged for us to come to Robbie's house. He lives in a flat away from his family. Hello. Welcome to my flat. This is my living room. It's really nice. This is my bedroom. It's quite big for a bedroom. How long have you been living here? About six months. How do you feel about living independently now? I feel very happy. So was you scared when you first started then? I was because I didn't know what to expect. What do you think we should put in the pack to help people? Support is out there and that's what I need to know. Hello, I'm John. I'm Louis' dad. Today our families are getting together and talking about how Robbie's mum coped with him moving independently. It was a big wrench when Robbie did move out and um, I wasn't sure whether it was going to work. I used to see him quite regularly but I've learned to take a backward step. I'm really proud of him. When you worry, yeah. obviously when you let them go, that whether they'll you know, be all right. So. Yeah. It's been brilliant to hear that somebody has moved out and have coped. Do you have to do your own ironing? Yes, I do. It has to be done, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Just because people have like learning disabilities, it doesn't mean they can't live independently and do things for themselves.